Hello and welcome to Drugs Plus. Whether you're here for exam revision or just general interest, I hope you find this video useful. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to support this channel so that I'm able to continue creating this content. In this video, I'm going to clear up a common area of confusion, the difference between selectivity and specificity. Many students tend to use these words interchangeably, but they are two distinct properties of drugs and any drug can be either, both, or neither. Drugs with specific action act directly on their receptor to revoke a response. For example, exenatide is specific to the GLP-1 receptor and its binding directly evokes a response. However, citagliptin is non-specific to the GLP-1 receptor, although it does produce the same response. So exenatide is specific and citagliptin is non-specific. If you want to know more about these drugs, I'll provide the links to my videos on GLP-1 analogues and DPP-4 inhibitors below. Conversely to this, a selective drug acts at one target and one target alone to produce a response. For example, tadisamil is a non-selective potassium channel blocker. However, Abutilide is a selective IKR blocker. Drugs with specific action act directly on their receptor and a selective drug acts at one target. So just to make sure you understand this concept, pause this video now and try to label each of these drugs as either selective or non-selective and either specific or non-specific. And here are the answers. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it useful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to support this channel so I'm able to keep creating these videos. I'll be back with more pharmacology videos soon.